Hi, I'm Tony from Martin Lynch and Sons. Very good uh, morning or evening or afternoon. Hope you've got a nice cuppa. Good afternoon. My name's Mark. Hello, I'm Jonathan here with Martin Lynch and Sons. Good morning, it's 2 e uh, here with another short video on a product we do. Hi, I'm Gary, um, here at Martin Lynch and Sons. Right, um, very good uh, afternoon, morning or evening, uh, whatever time of the day it is. Welcome to Something for the Easter Weekend, where my lovely staff, a few of the sales guys, are assembled. There's Tony, it's Mark. Jonathan is... Um, sweating over being attacked by a wasp or a bee which is buzzing around in his um, window. It all got all right now, you safe? It's gone now. Yeah, it's gone now, it's fine. Fantastic. Ready? Yeah, I'm ready. He's psyched up. He's psyched up and tight. Yeah, yeah, I've got, a, I've got one of those happy little faces. <laughs> <laughs> right. Hello there, Jonathan here at Martin Lynch and Sons and Happy New Year, welcome to 2020. Welcome to uh, the MLS yearly video review. Um, this is the first review of uh, 2020, a very eventful year to say the least. Um, January and February started the same as any other year and it was business as usual for uh, our YouTube channel uh, and the world in general. Uh, on our YouTube throughout January and February. Jonathan, good old Jonathan, kept us up to date with our used gear that was on offer with his weekly videos. And as ever, he was joined by some friendly and not so friendly faces. I also made a little um, behind the scenes walk around our premises, if you remember that, in February, giving you a glimpse of what goes on in the different departments at Lynch HQ in Staines upon Thames. It's such a lovely day here in Staines that Jonathan and I thought rather than stand on some vacant beach in the middle of nowhere. That'd be nice. Yeah, it'd be nice, yeah. yeah. Um, but it's January, so <laughs> <laughs> we thought we'd start outside the store because a lot of you haven't seen the delightful road that we're in. Look at that, what a road, eh? And also the store, which probably you've seen in, in videos in years gone by. So actually, in all seriousness, the railway station is at the top of this road turn left and it's actually on the left hand side that's how close Waterloo uh, main line into London is and Heathrow Airport is about two and a half miles three miles that way so come into the store right so um, I thought I'd just show uh, the shop we've got a couple of customers in here have come an awful long way to um, see the premises, they've been here many times of course. And uh, Tony, our sales manager, mustn't show his bald uh, spot by the way, because he keeps going on about that. Um, just, yeah, I know, he should really have a little hat, shouldn't he? So, it's a, um, a rainy Thursday afternoon. All busy here as you can see. We fly through to March and at the beginning uh, of the month, the first person from the UK passed away with coronavirus, unfortunately, and a virus that um, turned into a worldwide pandemic, as you know, and affecting everybody on the planet um, for a year. Um, uh, and we're still in it. Um, whilst Jonathan's uh, used videos continue to be uploaded weekly in March to all the introduction of virtual video visits, we called it. Jonathan here at Martin Lynch and Sons and welcome to the first in our series of virtual visits to the showroom. We understand at this current time of uh, coronavirus and COVID-19, you may not want to come down to the showroom. We completely understand that, but we're going to bring the showroom to you. Uh, more and more people being told to stay at home and businesses temporarily were closed or closing down. We thought it'd make it easier for everyone and allow them to browse our store virtually. We had no choice from the comfort of their computer or phone screens via YouTube videos. In these live field videos, each of our staff members would upload videos daily, showing everyone what we had on our display, um, because without that, we wouldn't be selling anything. March 23rd saw Boris declare full UK lockdown, meaning everyone in the UK had to stay at home to save lives and protect the NHS. 
For us here at MLS, this meant we had to close our doors to the general public and the majority of our staff had to work from home. We had a few skeleton staff, uh, my oldest son Dan and Gary, continuing our mail order business. This didn't mean our legendary YouTube content would stop. It just meant we had to change tact. Our webcams, tablets, smartphones at the ready. Less than two days after the lockdown announcement, we were all buzzing and busy creating videos from home and their personal offices. First couple of videos, I think, uploaded uh, from the members team, picking out some of their favorite products, as well as our Mark continuing the virtual video visit series from his personal office. Good afternoon. Hope you're keeping well. It's Mark here from MLS and Sons, G1DX is my call sign. Even I started getting a more involved creating videos from my home and garden. It's quite interesting to see um, the content video quality, how it quickly improved for all of us over the few weeks, all getting used to it. April. Jonathan still managed to pump out his used videos throughout April using his home studio and the website that's always kept up to date, by the way. Remember, we've got live feeds, so when it says it's in stock, generally it all is. Um, we jumped on the Zoom bandwagon and had online meeting like all the cool people were doing in April 2020. I'm not sure all the team were that happy as they actually had to put uh, clothes on to work rather than sit around in their gym jams, but it was nice to catch them. <laughs> And also for me to see they were actually working from home, because you know what I'm like. April the 17th, we uploaded a bumper 45 minute lockdown special video featuring most of the sales team talking about their current favorite or notable products. May swiftly followed um, the first YouTube in, in the month, in fact, saw my good self chatting to Graham. My old mate Somerville from BHI had two new products to introduce. Right, hello boys and girls, uh, ladies and gentlemen, good morning, good afternoon or good evening, whatever time you're watching this. I'm joined with uh, a great British manufacturer, which I always mention, of course, is my mate Graham from BHI. Hello, everybody. Uh, <laughs> there we are. Uh, I don't even know what time of day it is, Martin. No, neither have I. I've got no idea what time of the day it is. Obviously, first of all, I hope you're all keeping safe out there. And um, um, uh, yeah, yeah, I'm keeping hello. safe. You don't Please. mind if I put that on while I talk to you. Uh, look at that. Look at that. Uh, lockdown was extended for another three weeks. The country were adapting to life at home, and whilst we were all missing out on a lot of activities, there was certainly something about the blitz spirit in good old Blighty, and we were beginning to notice some positives. The first one being that you can speak to or interview anyone from anywhere in the world at any time. Everyone had figured out uh, how to use their webcams at this point, just about. So interviews like uh, the one we did with Graham, were far more cost-effective and environmentally friendly uh, than uh, Mr. Somerville coming to the store to make a video, because that wouldn't be right. Sadly, with almost every uh, and any event being cancelled or postponed, there wasn't any Dayton, um, there wasn't any ham show in, in Lincoln, nothing. So we did a Dayton video special with all our American products. Very good morning, afternoon or evening, wherever you are in the world. Welcome to uh, another something for the weekend, this special uh, Dayton weekend. And uh, as I'll be sh shortly, sh 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 shortly leading to Jonathan. Hello, I'm Jonathan from Martin Inch and Sons and welcome to this week's Something for the Weekend uh, video and this week it is our Dayton special. Um, probably the biggest announcement in May was the imminent release of the ICOM IC705. Not heard of that? Don't believe it. Production development being extremely tricky for any company all around the world. To hear that it was still going to happen and pretty well on time too is just the uh, good news we needed I think. June eventually saw non-essential shops reopening in the UK, but not until later in the month. So the start saw more home videos. I have to admit that I got the hang of it just about by now. and was beginning to showboat a bit, deciding to film some videos from the Lynchy Mobile, my little twizzy. And finally, I was allowed a bit more freedom, so I was going to take it. Lockdown seemed to have gotten me a bit nostalgic, nostalgic too. And I showed you guys some of the classic radios from my collection. July followed with lockdown eased slightly. July saw us back in the store with social distancing and stickers all around the floor. Jonathan and I uh, were back in the show doing videos with the team getting things back in the swing of it. Most of the vids throughout July 
are from me, so no doubt you noticed, either on the road or from home or in the store, including me finally getting my hands on a brand new IC705 with the unboxing at the end of the month. Very, very first company to do that in Europe, I do believe. With lockdown eased and things back to normal, uh, August saw the birth of MLS live streams with Gary and Jonathan going live and talking all things ham radio on Saturday afternoons. <laughs> that works. <laughs> We're miles away from each other. Yeah, thank you very much. Well, hello, welcome. Uh, I hope it's all working. I hope sure. someone's going to tell us if it's working. Yeah, someone will tell us if it's working. So no, actually, someone will tell us if it's not working. That's what will happen. Bear with, I'll just go and get ahead. Okay. That was everybody. First time doing a live stream, and this is uh, new ground for us. Once again, that was August, but it was a good start and an indication of things to come. We also introduced the Mac tuners in August, and in particular one for the new IC705, the Mac uh, 705. September kicked off with a Wuxon special video, um, with a cheeky appearance of the FT818ND, and ended with a pictorial tour of the Wuxon factory, because we've been selling Wuxon, and you can thank them for four metres back into the lobby. In between that, we did more live streams on YouTube, including some Hamfest specials over the days it would have been uh, Newark Hamfest. Hopefully we're going to be there this year, certainly next. Covid again in October, rose all over the world, strange month, but as ever we kept the videos coming to try and keep you involved and a Kebwood special from me. Gary and I also, also caught up with Vasily and Roman from Expert Electronics in Russia during a live chat from them with their HQ in Taro Rong. Uh, for, that was a hour and a half and happy to spill the beans and tell us what new products coming along as the uk headed for a second lockdown i made my way to the isle of Wight before i was put under what's basically house arrest and recorded a halloween special to round off the month hello good morning good afternoon good evening wherever you are in the world welcome to another edition of uh, martin lynch and sons something for the weekend today uh I'm not in Staines, as you can probably say, unless all of a sudden we appear to be on the coast. We're in uh, the little island of the Isle of Wight, which is um, off the south coast of the UK. Check it out if you've never been. Fantastic place. Um, November started with a second lockdown in the UK, um, as of November the 5th. Slightly more relaxed rules meant we uh, show them still open. That we're limited to click and collect and more staff are allowed in the store so we turn to even more live streams to keep you all in the loop weekly live streams every saturday along with our usual informative videos and black friday specials meant there were quite a few videos uploaded to our channel mlands.tv in november christmas month december with the second lockdown finally over but everyone's still extremely confused as to what they could do and what they couldn't do especially over christmas we kept the videos coming thick and fast by weekly in december with our saturday live streams accompanied by our weekly something for the weekend or sftw videos um, our saturday live streams becoming ever more popular we renamed them lynch's weekend webcast Hello, welcome to this week's weekend webcast uh, from your friends here at Martin Lynch and Sons in Staines. Uh, and they continue to go live every Saturday. We've come a long way where it all started uh, with virtual video visits back in March and that feels like a lifetime ago, it really does. Um, we end the craziest year with a Christmas specials video followed by my yearly something for the new year uh, video. Um, I think that's it really because we're now coming into uh, 2021. Um, we'd like to thank all of you for your patronage, for support, um, not just on our uh, MLANS TV channel, but also um, uh, supporting us by purchasing product from uh, Martin Lynch and Sons in Staines. Um, we've recently introduced podcasts and I know you're enjoying those. Thank you for the support on that. It looks like 2021 is going to be a better year. COVID uh, vaccinations are rolling out thick and fast, but that's for 2021. I hope I've covered it all. I hope you've joined, enjoyed the little collage of what we've been doing and what we're up to. I'm so looking forward to a few months. Uh, in a few months time, we can actually open the store and the doors again. Until then, keep safe and enjoy ham radio. Bye bye.